Hi, this is Simon Leung from SimonLeung.com and FluencySecrets.com. And today, we're going to talk about this article. That's right, how to pronounce the in American English pronunciation. Easy one. Easy top love. Let's see about that one. I'm sure it's easy in theory because of how frequently this word is used. But just because it's used a lot doesn't mean that there are no rules. After all, it is English, right? Confusilo. Now keep in mind, the A or A uh and AN we talked about before are used to refer to generic things, which means that they're not specific, which makes them indefinite articles. On the other hand, because with this article, we use it to refer to specific things. We will call it a definite article. Okay, long. Now, I don't want to turn this whole thing into a grammar and terminology lesson any more than necessary because, well, that's boring, right? And not what these videos are about. So let's focus back on pronunciation. Let's give this pronunciation a try with one of our favorite examples. How would you say this? This one, huh? Okay. <laughs> I try again. First of all, it's spelled T H E, right? And with any word that begins with T H, you must make that T H sound with your tongue against the back of your teeth, like so. Great. Let's try again. Oh, hey. As you may or may not know, there are two ways to pronounce this word. One is the, another is the. So how do you know when to say which one? Well, believe it or not, there is a grammar rule. Remember how for the previous indefinite articles, we used A for consonant sounds and AN for vowel sounds? Well, the same applies here for this definite article in that for consonant sounds, we use THE, and for vowel sounds, we use the. We. Yes, indeedy. So, let's try this one again. Okay. Because apple begins with the vowel letter A, the correct pronunciation should be the apple. Hey, I know, I know, I know. The apple. Hey. The apple. Hey. The apple. Let's try a few more, shall we? Together, huh? Starting with some consonant words. The ball, the cap, the pencil, the cable, the scissors, the thumb, the cup, the binoculars, the phone holder, the book, the brush, the microphone, the ruler, the box, the charger, the bafaya. What? Huh? Please. Let's now try it with the vowel sounds. A to get the get the la. The award, the envelope, the apps. You see? The alarm, the umbrella, the oven mitt, the egg, the opener, the onion, the iced coffee, the unicorn, the earphones. Why, why, why? What? The iron. The eraser. The electric shaver. So basically, it's for consonant sounds and for vowel sounds. This time, we are referring to specific things. That's why we call it a definite article. Just like reading book, ma. Once upon a time, the story began. The end. If you have any questions about any of the definite and indefinite articles that we talked about in this article series, feel free to drop them down in the comments below and I will personally respond to them to help you out. You are welcome. In the next video, 
we will start a new series on the pronunciation of commonly mispronounced words even for native speakers. So be sure to subscribe and tick that bell so that you don't miss any updates. Hiyo. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one with more English fluency secrets. The apple is delicious. The egg is broken. The video is over. The end. Bye bye.